Aircraft OEMs and MROs continue to look for productivity and resource improvements from aviation coatings, while plane owners and airlines demand improved durability and maintenance solutions. To answer these demands, Sherwin-Williams developed the Skyscapes Aerospace Paint System. Skyscapes is a base coat clear coat system that provides user-friendly application, dramatically reduces the process time, materials used, and resources needed to apply the paint, and offers excellent gloss and color retention for a highly durable, stunning finish. To help your company receive maximum benefit from this breakthrough product, Sherwin-Williams is providing you with this training tool to help you get the best possible outcome the first time and every time you apply Skyscapes. Because Skyscapes is different than single-stage coating systems, the methods and steps shown in this video are unique. You will be shown the proper procedures for applying the Skyscapes base coat clear coat system using existing spray equipment and facilities. Once the aircraft surface has been properly prepared, wipe the entire surface with Sherwin-Williams CM01010 pre-paint wiping solvent to remove contamination. Use the wipe on, wipe off method. When this wipe down is completed, the plane is ready to receive its first base coat color of skyscapes. Preparing skyscapes involves several typical steps. First, the base coat color material should be machine shaken for 10 to 15 minutes. Then combine the base, hardener and appropriate activated reducer according to the mixing instructions on the product data sheet and thoroughly stir the mix. After mixing, check and record the mix's viscosity. Allow a 15 to 30 minute induction period. After induction is completed, Filter the base coat mix as it is transferred to the painting pots. For Skyscape's application, all types of professional spray equipment are acceptable. The spray gun should be adjusted to produce fine atomization. The temperature of the material, airframe and paint hanger should be at the room temperature range. Ideally, humidity should be less than 85%. Now apply the base coat in one continuous closed film cross coat. It should be applied in a manner similar to applying a primer. The thickness of the base coat only needs to be 1.2 to 2 mils dry film thickness or until color hiding is achieved. This is significantly less than traditional single stage coating systems. For mica and metallic effect base coats, apply two closed film cross coats at least 30 minutes apart to achieve the desired finish. The mica requires a suitable color ground coat. The metallic requires a singular color background to ensure color consistency and repairability. Each base coat color or effect only needs to dry approximately two hours at room temperature before beginning the masking for a second color or applying the clear coat. No baking is needed. Work on the next layer can begin immediately after the two hour dry time. No sanding of the base coat is needed. Apply stripe layouts and masking, making certain only the areas receiving the next color are exposed. After the masking is complete, wipe down the exposed areas with the pre-paint wiping solvent. Mix the base coat color with the proper ratio of hardener and activated reducer, making certain to record the viscosity. And after the proper induction period, apply the second color. These drying and mixing steps should be repeated for every color applied to the aircraft. At this point, the aircraft is ready to receive its all-important adhesion promoter, more commonly known as ADPRO. This process has two important functions. First, it ensures the base coat is conditioned for good intercoat adhesion for the clear coat. This makes sanding unnecessary. Second, it helps to prevent contamination, tape marring, tape gum residue, or unseen finger marks from showing through the clear coat finish. Sherwin-Williams has developed two types of ADPRO. CMO 850AP5 is a single component material, ready to spray, that is ideal for small areas of the aircraft. CMO 850AP8 is a two-component material 
suitable for all types of aircraft, large or small. Before applying the adhesion promoter, wipe down the entire painted surface with the pre-paint wiping solvent using the wipe on, wipe off method. When using the two component ADPRO material, you will need to mix it with ADPRO hardener and reducer according to the product data sheet. Stir the ADPRO mix thoroughly. As with the base coat, record the proper viscosity. Now apply the ADPRO of choice in one continuous closed film cross coat. The thickness of the two component ADPRO, AP8, only needs to be one half to one mil dry film thickness. The single component AP5 ADPRO can be up to one half mils. At room temperature, the single component material, CMO850 AP5, may be overcoated within 30 minutes to five hours. The two component material, CMO850 AP8, may be overcoated within 30 minutes to eight hours. To prepare the clear coat material, mix it according to the product data sheet with hardener and the chosen activated reducer. Allow a 15 to 30 minute induction period. Filter the clear coat mix as it is transferred to the spray guns. The clear coat should be applied in two separate continuous closed film coats with a total dry film thickness between 1.6 to 2.2 mil for maximum performance. After the final coat of clear coat has been applied, allow the appropriate dry time. Once dry, the Skyscape's clear coat finish will have excellent gloss and distinctness of image and should for many years to come. Sherwin-Williams Aerospace prides itself on providing high quality paint systems and customer support. If you have any questions about Skyscapes and its application, don't hesitate to ask Sherwin-Williams.